in the Facebook group, there is a video where I'm going through, okay, does he have a red? Does he have a black? You know, test your knowledge. In this presentation, what I'd like to do is read these guys' charts for you, if that would be okay, and to help you recognize. So I'm going to do it with you, for you, and then you can test yourself in the study group if you want to later on. And the interesting thing about these guys, the presentation that came with um, Rave ABCs in order to teach this was a whole bunch of people like, I didn't know half of them because they were all from like the 60s and 70s, you know, just like, who are these people? Actors and actresses. I'm like, okay, I'm going to do something different. And I had been asked, invited by Jovian Archive to write an article on Donald Trump. It was the first analysis that I ever did. So here on the slide, you can see it links over to the analysis, the full analysis of his chart. What I'm going to do is link over to his My Body Graph and just read his chart. So we'll have practice um, taking a look at how would you read somebody's chart. It's easy with my body graph because we, or the Maya Mechanic software, where we can go over and read what's going on over here, you know, and um, contemplate the basic broad strokes of what he is. So we see that he is a manifesting generator, technically an emotional generator with manifesting potential emotional generator because that is the pure emotional generator channel our only emotional generator channel and then we have two manifestor channels so manifesting potential so his keynote as a not self would be frustration and anger because anger is in these channels and there's also frustration here when operating out of alignment from the openness trying to get things done really quickly holding on to things and making spontaneous decisions um, not knowing what to do, where to go, so it's constantly changing direction or identity or behavior, not knowing what's inspiring, so chasing after every shiny object syndrome, any of those decision-making processes, making spontaneous decisions, because he's certain that he's right about it, will lead to the not-self of the body, the body responding with resentment of um, this deep, deep, deep frustration, resentment coming from here, but deep, deep, deep frustration and anger. And that's the not self keynote. What he's really here for is to build large businesses, because we have a channel here and here, that are going to bring him satisfaction. And his authority, if he would wait patiently for clarity to come rather than making spontaneous choices because he's certain about where things should go but waiting patiently for the right direction to come then he will have an awareness of something being really satisfying for him and bring about peace on earth eden bring about a new eden okay he's here to be an authority on caution throwing caution to the wind or being very cautious <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I haven't followed him lately much, but I see Tracy laughing, so glad that that resonates. Um, <laughs> what we're looking at as far as his channels, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to switch over to the body graph library so that um, I can click on things and show, and it'll be easier for me too. I don't have as much stuttering happening. So let's find, oh, hopefully it'll work. Let's find Mr. Trump in here. And then we'll talk about his channels and their red and black. So you have a question about the 59.6? Sure, go ahead. I just, what, what is it about that channel that um, indicates that that person is here to big, build big businesses? Okay, if it's correct for them, there is a tendency to um, build sacral generated channel. Generators mm -hmm. build our world. This channel, this channel, and this channel, and this channel are all about building our world, building okay. big, big business. In this case, 14.2 can do small business as well. So mm. you look at Richard Branson. He has this um, channel as well. Yeah, I know someone with that channel. That's why I'm asking. Are they, are they into quite it? Quite emotional. Oh, um, really? Quite, quite emotional. Uh -huh. um, yeah, but they're actually in business for themselves. They're a business coach. Okay. Okay, so maybe coaching bigger businesses? They're coaching individuals. Maybe oh. they should be coaching in a business setting or something. That's kind of why it spoke to me. 
Oh, okay. Well, mm -hmm. it depends on the full context of the chart, but yeah. um, they can be consultants that go into larger businesses or coaching other people who want to build large businesses. Okay. That could be another way that it could show up. It depends. Okay. Yeah. I'm, I'm really uh, having trouble with this. How do I put it back in without making this? I'm so bummed. Because I really wanted to be able to just like go down and use this actually because it's so much fun. Like it's, but I screwed it up earlier um, by popping it out. And I know I don't know how to get it back. Oh, I did it. I did it. Yay. <laughs> okay, there we go. So now um, we just did the basics of Donald Trump. Let's go into his channels because the channels are the life force. So the first thing we want to start with, you can see it's listed here. What creates his type? is the channel of mating, a design focused on reproduction. So it's not just reproduction as in sexuality and humanity reproduction, but also what's gonna support reproduction. Businesses, large businesses support us being able to have families and to support our families. So we also have the channel of acceptance, the design of an organizational being, where we have um, his certainty, his mental certainty and concepts about what where things are going or where things should go, what he thinks, his opinions. He's always sharing his opinions and it's very certain. Can't, or, can't argue with this guy because he's certain about his opinions. Channel of money, design of a materialist. We know he's a materialist. He is, owns a lot of property. This is about owning things. Gate 45 is ownership. And the channel of money is about having things and it's about control and it's about domination and submission you tell i tell you what to do because you have to because i'm the boss gate 45 being the ceo okay 45 five leader leadership then we have um our channel of transitoriness a design of a jack of all trades where we have somebody who is unaware of his tendency to go all over the map perhaps maybe now that he's uh, older, he recognizes that. But really, if you look back at his life, what has he been? He's done all kinds of businesses, right? I mean, all over the place. It did all over the place, meaning, you know, not necessarily knowing his identity. So I think he was selling steaks at one point. I mean, he's done a lot of different things with his life. So we have a totally unconscious channel here and here. Those would be tunnels between the sacral center his response ability and his emotional clarity are unconscious to his conscious thinking mind. And this is what he's here to base his decisions off of, his emotional clarity. So the body, recognizing the body's awareness um, for what is going to be most satisfying has to be through asking, not through initiating, not through um, starting things. And what you might find is part of the reason why he maybe did a lot of things too is because he started a lot of things and didn't maybe necessarily finish. He's not the finisher, he's the starter, you know? And if you're starting out of mind's process, then it goes all wonky and off the map and you get really rageful and angry um, and not necessarily happy with what's going on in your life. So we have a red and a black here in the channel of money. So partially perhaps conscious of the leadership uh, capacity or potential, but unconsciously aware of one's egoism. So if you look at this uh, presentation that I've created for you, I want to read something to you, one of his quotes. I think I'm actually humble. I think I'm much more humble than you would understand. And I don't think anybody of us can really recognize that. I mean, I'm not that familiar with him. I don't keep up with him all the time. I'm not his best friend, but I don't think humble is in the dictionary. When you look Donald Trump up, that, that humble would be, his name face would be under humble. Um, so we have unconscious egoism, the egoist right here, a couple of different 26s. And I think, I think, I think about himself, not accurate, not necessarily. That's his, you know, perhaps projection that he would like to think of himself, but not necessarily. We see we have um, the red and black up here too. So mentally certain about his concepts, his thinking, how he explains his thinking, but maybe not necessarily aware all the time of what he's putting out or how it appears to other people. 
because it's kind of out of proportion. What, what he says and what he does may be not congruent. Even though this is a single definition, there is a lot of unconscious energy at play that he might not be aware of. So completely um, open head center and his mind, his mind's process and his brain's process, very receptive and passive. So not necessarily strategic and yet living in a strategic world, this is my same variable. So we have a future brain, future mind and an old fashioned life that forces us to be strategic. It can be very uncomfortable. And as a one, three, first and third line, there is a very um, challenge, big challenge in this life to establish one's solid foundation if they're not honoring their own unique potential of being responsible, responsibility, and being emotionally clear. So we have no roads. So if we took a look at his design from a personality's perspective, completely open, inconsistent. Mind's process is not reliable here, not at all. So if you're deeply identified with the I, I, I inside of the head about the self, then your body is doing something totally different than what your mind thinks that you're doing. <laughs> and if you're not aware, you're living two lives basically that may be at odds with each other. So you're desperately attempting to present a certain kind of identity to another person, have a fixed identity to other people, you know, afraid of judgment, too much self judgment, um, afraid of failure, and afraid of tomorrow so there's all this energy to make spontaneous decisions and to hurry up and do it now get it started now because we need to make sure that we resolve all of these um, fears for the future where things are going and establish a logical working frequency and so because we have these opinions and i said this is what i think i'm going to have to follow what i think rather than what my body is telling me i need to do and so it'll show up as resentment and anger uh, resentment, anger, and particularly frustration. So on this body graph um, slide here, Deck, you can, you can practice like, okay, on this slide, what does he have? And then if you get good at it, you can start naming the channels. And here we can see we have two tunnels, two red and black channels, and no conscious channels for Donald Trump. And here's some more. Um, this more of this quote stuff i, I want to read a couple of these what separates the winners from losers is how a person reacts to each new twist of fate so seeing things from winners and losers from power uh 26 and 45 are his nodal environments. so who's got who's winning who's losing who's got the money he says i don't do it for the money i've got enough much more than i'll ever need i do it to do it Deals are my art form, 26, salesperson, a couple of those 26s in his design. Here he's in it as, his pres as our, our president, we will no longer surrender this country or its people to the false song of globalism. The nation state remains a true, the true foundation for happiness and harmony. Okay, I'm gonna stop right there. Nation state, us versus them, tribalism, yeah? It's not about globalism, it's about our own people and what's best for us. It's thinking about you know, building that wall and all of his um, policies. So here, uh, that's tribal. I am skeptical of international unions and that tie us up and bring America down and will never enter America into any agreement that reduces our ability to control, control our own affairs. Actually, throughout my life, the two greatest assets have been mental stability and being like really smart. I'm like really smart. I went, to, went from a very successful businessman to a top TV star to president of the United States on my first try. I think that I wouldn't qualify not as smart, but as genius and a very stable genius as that. Not a humble ego, not a humble ego. Um, because it's all I, 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 I. And in a healthy state, what a 2145 is about 
is we, what's best for we. And you can see that he's doing what he thinks is best for America, but not necessarily seeing us as a part of that global uh, family, that, that unity of uh, that we need to do what's best for all of us. He's more of the ownership, yeah? And so that is our Donald Trump in a nutshell here. If I could just talk to the um, sun earths on both sides real briefly, we talked about caution, ideas, gate of peace. So if we were talking about true self, what a cross of Eden could do is bring about Eden, re-establish re Eden on this planet, Garden of Eden, you know, in that sense. Here on the third line of these two gates, crisis, and conflict, sharing crisis and conflict, and perhaps riding around on that wave of drama and new experiences, that's part of what he's putting out there into the world. So making a lot of mistakes in crisis and conflict is part of what his life experience is, is leading him to. Bonds made and broken with people, we know that he had a lot of hit, um, sexual interactions and you can see that that's clearly their allegiance or rejection six conflict gate six line three and then 59 which is about the one night stand being intimate with somebody penetrating into somebody this is the aura breaker what gate 59 and six coming together is we call it an aura breaker because it literally because it's so strong of a magnet it can penetrate into other people's um auras and pull them in, bring them in on whatever it is that this person is responding to doing. So it's almost like time stops. Remember, or you'll learn when we talk about the tribal uh, aspects, I might move this class till after circuitry because the tribal aspects are timeless. It's almost like there's no time. So when you pulled into an experience with a 59.6, it's like when you're going into a movie theater and you come back out two or three hours later and it's still daylight and you're like, wow, it felt like a lifetime. Time just kind of stops or it, it, it changes when you have this kind of experience here with this person. It's an experience creator, basically, what this guy does. So um, that's it for, for Donald for now. And there's more detailed because I went through it uh, in a deeper way on the description on the website if you feel like reading that, if that's interesting. Next, we have Hillary Clinton. And Hillary Clinton was a uh, person who he ran against and our former president's wife. And you can see, I'm not really certain of the time. It could be that this channel isn't there, but with this, this is the best guesstimate that we could find. I did my final uh, analysis for human design analysis um, certification by request by Linda Bennell. So here on the blog is the written, and I think I still have the audio up there. Might be, might be down, but it, it, I also did an audio. And in order to pass your analyst exam, you had to do it in half an hour. You had to do a full analysis in half an hour. So it took a lot of planning, and I even sped up my voice a little bit so I could make it under the half an hour um, time frame. But what we're looking at here is another one, three. And here's the cross of the unexpected. So let me pull up Hillary Clinton's chart. Oops, not there. On here. Where did it go? Did I? Oh, I see a chat. Hang on. Uh, you're in the family with the hotel, so listen only mode today. Okay, no problem. And we'll pull up Hillary. There she is, single definition as well. And we see that she, like we mentioned, one, three, cross of the unexpected, to respond. This is not an emotional generator. This is a pure manifesting generator with the 3420. That is our channel of charisma, a design of where awareness must become deed. You can see that right there. And she also has, in this example, a design of leadership for good or bad channel of the alpha this is our these are our elected leaders leaders by majority vote you know not the tribal leaders of you must because I, you have to because i say so but elected leadership here channel of the alpha and then we have a channel of structuring design of individuality from genius to freak which brings a unique mind who has certain about her concepts 
her insights and here to explain them to provide guidance to those who are seeking more and more efficiency from our world. So she has two of the channels that make us human as a collective species because it's the most common channels that we have, 4323, 3420, and this one being that last one, the channel of community. So as a design, she needs to wait for recognition or for um, asking, wait for responding to happen, the availability to respond. And we have a full tunnel with a partial overpass, full tunnel between 3420, partial overpass here with the 34. So gate 34 can bring rage into the experience as a not self because it has a deep need for personal, individual empowerment. 34 is the gate of power. And we can see that we have it in Jupiter. I guess I'm getting a little more detailed with her. Where's the other 34 here? Uh, there, in the nose. So in a not self, both first lines, she can be somewhat of a bully if you've um, heard any of the rumors about what she behaves like behind closed doors. Yeah, that's the first line in 34 is the bully. And she is a first line, so it's going to resonate with the profile. The waiting for the asking needs to come so that she doesn't try to start things in order to prove herself off of some fantasy land idea that makes her think that she needs to do something really quickly, do it spontaneously because she's afraid of for her own survival and because she needs to take a risk to find meaning in her life because she's afraid of challenging authority or standing up and defending basic and fundamental human rights, which is what 18s do, or not having enough depth. So taking on too much responsibility out of fear, trying to take care of everybody else in order to start something that's going to get her someplace, thinking that she has to prove herself or her value, and avoiding confrontation and truth, so hiding behind a false smile and lying, if you recognize that based on trying to um, avoid the crisis of inexperience. And then the undefined, totally open head center that is open to all this mental pressure to doubt, particularly to doubt uh, about where things are going. And so shiny object syndrome here, or maybe just not knowing what's interesting or inspiring. All of those things can feed into her not self purpose. And instead of waiting for the asking, we'll initiate new courses of action. So again, one, three profile, somebody who is here to be an authority here. It's an authority on risk taking gate 28 fear of dying before you've achieved your purpose. So being very prepared and looking for the purpose in life. So maybe taking risks out of fear so that life feels like it has meaning. And she's grounding that in her um, selfishness. This is fixed in the selfishness. You can see that there in the earth. There is that selfishness fixed in selfishness. This is not about other people. This is about her own um, survival, her own survival. So wanting to be a leader based not on what is best for the tribe necessarily, because that's not consistent anywhere, but if people are looking for an alpha, she's willing to st step up if she gets what she wants out of the bargain. And then we have uh, 31 unconscious, 31, 41. So channels of the alpha have the 41 that is about this pressure to desire a new experience from life, to improve upon life's experience as humans. And then we're grounding that in the gate of influence, 31, which gives us the ability to lead based on pattern recognition of where things should go. So very able to lead if, if that, that the asking is there and the, responsing, it, the responsibility, the response is there. And as long as it's correct, we'll be a, a leader. Now it could be a bad thing, if she's doing it for the wrong reasons, it could be a very bad thing. Alphas, people will follow. People will follow alphas just because they're alphas. So we gotta be very aware that our alphas are operating in alignment and not in um, out of alignment or out of integrity. 
and she's got a brilliant mind. You can see from, um, if you've watched any of the things about her, that she was very, very intelligent, is very, very intelligent, and can talk her way out of anything, it seems like, um, or just avoid it. <laughs> And we have a mind that is definitely seeing big picture view and far reaching because this is all sixth line, um, sometimes making mistakes in her communication of her insights. But really what structuring channels do is make things more efficient for our world or the natural guides because of the genetic relationship between the codons of this channel and this channel. They're natural guides for 3420s. Really, really helpful to have that in your own design, <laughs> I would imagine, so that you don't make so much of a mess. And this is her nodal environments, you can see here. I'm wondering how this is, uh, oh, you said that that's, I was gonna say, how is this landing with you? And Tracy said, that's totally my son. He has the whole channel too. Which channel was it, Tracy? I didn't catch that. 3420. Oh, that one. Mm -hmm. There is a deep need for personal empowerment here because it's part of integration. And we're going to talk about that, I think, uh, next week. I think we talk about that. Circuitry, when we get into circuitry. So that is our brief overview of Hillary Clinton. Again, there's more detail at the link there. Next. I also got invited to talk about Barack Obama. It's so odd to me that I would look, I mean, I didn't plan this at all. I didn't plan writing about all of these at all. Um, when I was at the BG5 Business Institute and they started asking for content, they wanted something on Barack Obama because he was um, going out of office. And so there is an overview of Barack Obama's business design, not the human design perspective, but more of the business language. So if you want to learn more about him, you would go to that link there. And so let's pull up that. Where did it go? Let's pull up him in this one where I can talk about. Oh, and I didn't even do uh, here. I, I, I think I forgot. Yeah, I, red and black and there's a road. So we have a road, a red and black, a tunnel with a partial overpass. Okay, now I feel satisfied that we can move on to Barack. 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 Here we go. Barack Obama. Very easy to analyze from our um, ABC perspective because there's just one channel. And that one channel is a red and a black, as you can see. So now we have a projector. Instead, we first we started with a generator that was emotional. Then we went to a pure manifesting generator. And now we're talking about a projector. So projectors here to wait for the clear recognition invitation and for him to be even more patient, to be emotionally clear before making decisions. Here to be successful and to guide others' success, guide others' manifestation, guide others uh, in their work and in their ability to do the work, improve themselves and guide the identity and guide the awareness, awareness, inner truth. So we have a single definition, one channel, a red and a black that we mentioned. This is the channel of recognition, a design of focused energy, design of focused energy, the strength of imagination in BG5 language. And we have a natural leader, natural, gate, gate uh, line two, natural, leader, trusted leader, line six. And on the left angle cross of refinement here, he is here to have a recognition of awareness about what we as a collective species should carry on into the future based on what happened, based on a memory, remembering. So he has the ability to let go and retreat, to enjoy privacy, to be a leader who enjoys privacy. When, as an abstract being, Abstract beings find their strength in awareness of what happened in the past as far as the whole cycle of experience, where it went, where it led, what happened, and what the lesson of the moral of the story is, we could say, the lessons of the past. So we have a 33, retreat the gate of privacy, a 33 that has the ability to disassociate, sixth line, let go and retreat, enjoy privacy. When you're away from the experience and you've had the time to digest it, 
properly to, to contemplate and reflect upon it. Then when you're clear, you can share. So this is a management, one, two, three, uh, four. There's a lot of management potential gates in here, five. And this one is leading based on what happened in the past. And where he's grounding that as a personality is in the gate of wanting or the gate of need, what is needed. And here we can see in the sixth line, it's called the recluse. So as a president, we could, we could kind of get that sense of him, like a little bit more of that aloofness, a little more objective, a little more um, not in the public limelight so much as, you know, the way that Trump is, as an example blah, blah, blahing all the time, all, all over the place. He was more uh, stated, refined, yeah, elegant in, in a way you could say. And that has a lot to do with what he's here for. Unconsciously, the sun earth is in the G center where we have the gate of the driver and we have it also in his mercury. So uh, a natural expression of genius when it comes to the vision of what our, our, our company corporation <laughs> the corporation of america could go because this is where we have the vision of the corporation is in gate two whether it be large or small business and that's what he was unconsciously talking about and then on the other side the expression of the self he was grounding his vision in a direction that was unique and we call this love is light in the second line so natural uh, wisdom of where perhaps we should go as humanity, as a species. We have the gate of the politician here of those last two. They didn't have the gate 15, but here we do have the archetype of a politician, gate 15 in his uh, Venus. So being influential when it comes to loving humanity, we could see that in him. Yeah, this uh, acceptance of the human condition and wanting to lead or refine us through that experience. Hmm. That is about all that I feel like sharing. I could go, I could go on for hours. You know, I, what I've noticed lately in my readings is that time can fly like that and I could go through everybody's chart and it's like, oh, two hours has gone by. Whoa, how did that happen? So I don't want to do that with this because we have a lot more to take care of. And uh, some quotes here. And just a couple of quotes on Barack that might be interesting. I'm a living testimony to the moral force of nonviolence. I know there's nothing weak, nothing passive, nothing naive in the creed in the lives of Gandhi and King. So you can kind of see, sense his refinement in that sense. Um, the belief that peace is desirable is rarely enough to achieve it. Peace requires responsibility. Peace entails sacrifice. That's why NATO continues to be indispensable. So that yes, we can spirit, that's part of his process of supporting his tribe and being in control as a executive, as somebody who took charge, that 21 can also be a leader in that sense of a large group of people, 45 or 21 or all both. So the next person, <laughs> Now, can I remember why? Bernie was actually another person that was running against Hillary. And so I wrote this one for Jovian Archive as well as part of their series. And when we were in the political um, field, the political uh, time frame of, of uh, political season. So there's the article about Bernie. Now, Bernie, again, unfortunately, don't have a necess necessar necessarily an accurate time. So I didn't get into the details of um, the color tone and all that stuff like I did with, um, with Donald. But here we have very easy to analyze chart in this ABC sense because it's just like Barack Obama, one channel, and we have a red and a black. And so let me pull up Mr. Bernie on this side. Here he is. And now we see another projector. And this projected channel is also responsible in large businesses, large groups, to be a person in charge or a manager because um, that's just what it does. It's, we call this the warrior of the wall as far as what it does in a large group of people. Is it 
backs up the person, whoever's in charge in the 2145 realm, as far as the CEO, that person. So it, it will strengthen the corporation's ability to be competitive in the business world. So the COO, I believe it is, of Facebook has this channel. Okay, um, I think her name is Sandra, if you look her up. But she's got only that channel and perhaps she might also have a, um, a channel in the mental projector realm. I don't know what her time is exactly, but she definitely has that channel. So Bernie Sanders, projector, waiting for the invitation because if not, there is going to be bitterness here to help other people to success. Fifth line, as a personality, are naturally projected upon to be our leaders. Remember, fifth line is about general, savior, saint, the person that's going to rescue, the person that has solutions in times of crisis. That's what our five ones are here to do. And here's the left angle cross of dominion dominion. So we have somebody who is here to be a messenger. Uh, make promises about re releasing us from the confusion of what it is to be human in this life, to ground that awareness of the confusion in the doubts for the future and to find inspiration is what his wisdom potential is. So inspiration, looking for answers, looking for realizations, wisdom potential, not knowing what to think, totally open ashna. So maybe trying to convince everybody that he's certain in the not self. Uh, fear of failure over here, where we have an awareness potentially of what's going to be safe and healthy, but personally making spontaneous decisions out of fear, not healthy. Here, provoking people, gate 39 is about provocation. And here, making a decision spontaneously quickly from pressure and stress, not helpful, not healthy. Here, here to be wise about the crisis and conflict when it comes to dealing with our social, emotional, and relational intelligence, and not here to make decisions based on avoiding confrontation and truth. And then we have the throat center, here to guide manifestation. So we have somebody who has a potential for educating, 845, the gatherer, educating and being very influential when it comes to educating because we have the unconscious sun and Jupiter, Jupiter part of his um, law, personal law and protection. So very strong guide for manifestation. We also have an awareness or a potential ability to express what he knows, his voice in the now of contemplation, his leadership and his contribution of individual efforts to group goals. The consistency in the design is a defined G, politician gate, love of the body gate, and also the 25 is about the love of the universe or having a, a place to be loving in the universe. We would think of this channel as like the belief structure of the business, the, um, what do you call those people? The priests, the priesthood of a corporation as far as this is what we believe and this is what we intend and this is what um, we need to put first in order for all of us to have an identity that is unified. So that's the responsibility here, to have the egoic willpower, his authority, to be able to make decisions that are going to empower the large group of people if he's in a large group of people. And that's our left angle cross of dominion. So waiting for recognition and invitation and then having his egoic willpower be the deciding factor. And that is an overview of Bernie Sanders. So our next place, where did it go? Here we go. Our next place, you can see the split view and a couple of quotes. The United States of America is the only, only major country on earth that does not provide paid family and medical leave. That must change. That's not supportive. That's not supportive in our ability to have a healthy corporation of America. <laughs> now, Arnold Schwarzenegger, I did not write anything about, but he fit into the category of politician, and it's a really complex chart when you look at it. So this one, we can see we have a red and black. We have a road or a unconscious tunnel, a tunnel with a partial overpass. We have a road here between the 3410, 
channel of convictions following, or channel of exploration following one's own convictions, the full um, overpass between the 34 and 20, that is our channel of charisma, design of awareness where thoughts must, or design of where thoughts must become deeds or awareness must become deeds, the road and um, red and black of the Ajna Center, that is our process of awareness. So I can see that I'm starting to go bleh, get a little bit tired of talking. Um, so I'll, I'll pause after Arnold and we'll see if there's any questions and maybe need a break. The full overpass channel right there, full overpass 3420, a red and a black channel where we have this 1762. The tunnel with the partial overpass when we have this 2145. And then roads with a partial overpass. That would be the 1020 and then the 3410 as well because it's a full road and it's got a partial overpass. Yeah, it's a really complex chart. <laughs> and here's some quotes about Arnold if you care to read about him. So Jarl, is, is this interesting to you? Finding it um, helpful, useful, yeah. And Tracy, if there's anything that you would like to ask Sarah, Sarah, I saw you popped off camera, so probably a little busy there. But what we'll do is take a, a quick break and we'll come back and finish up this presentation. Okay, so I'm gonna pause the recording. All right, so I'm back. Let's finish up our look at these um, politicians with John Kennedy. And John Kennedy, you can see here, was one of our American presidents as well. Um, we have one of the most well-known politicians in modern history, 35th president of the United States. He was instrumental in bringing the country out of stagnation that it found itself in the Second World War. His economic reforms, strong support of civil rights, commitment to space exploration programs saw him gain rapid popularity in the country. Leader of one of the two post-World War II superpowers, JFK as he was known, played a pivotal role in global geopolitics as the United States clashed with the Soviet Union in the Cold War. From the failed attempt to overthrow Castro's regime in Cuba, to supporting the Western Bloc in Berlin, to the resolution of the Cuban Missile Crisis without armed conflict, JFK was at the heart of several key historical events during his tenure as the United States President. So I have some quotes here that might be interesting to look at, and we can see that he is a 3-5 cross of planning. Cross of planning, which has the 3740 as his core essence and grounding and balance of his unconscious form. So as we can see, a projector with an emotional intelligence, his solar plexus being the authority. So we have somebody who has the availability to guide or lead when it comes to the bargains that are made. The bargains that are made are part of his genius, his zone of genius between, um, as, as a leader of the country, between countries and having an ability to figure out what works based on what he recognizes or identifies with as far as the pattern of how things are moving into the future, his leadership being part of how he guides manifestation, his voice of change and progress, his beliefs, his knowing and the way he thinks, all being places where he can recognize how things should manifest or how things should go. So if he were patient and waiting for recognition, invitation, being emotionally clear, he provided willpower for us to be able to make progress as a country, for us to have the right direction based on what happened in the past, where his vision was for the company, for the corporation of America, and being a um, politician by nature, by birth, he's is truth, transformation, and psychology, the gate of extremes, and a leader at that. 